Hello and welcome. Let me make sure my mic is working. Hello and welcome to the 87 Legends at Phoenix. Yeah, well this uh, this car's tight. <laughs> it's tough to drive. We are the number one, and we are in Gavin's viewer time slot. It is the last official race of the season on week 12. Gavin has set up a unofficial, hold on, volume, sorry, uh, an unofficial finale for this series that should be pretty fun as a hosted event, but uh, as for official races, this is the final race. Uh, I expect to do terribly, as I usually do in this car, as I have all season. But, you know, we'll, uh, uh, we'll try, we'll try something, we'll try not to be terrible. Seems like I've got a decent idea of how to do a hot lap, but, um... Once I get past lap one, I don't know what happens after that. So, that should be interesting. Looks like I got a nice one in right there. Feeling good about that. Someone else is ahead of me, though. I think the track might be a little bit faster than it was in practice. Because it feels like I shouldn't have gotten that good of a lap time. Didn't feel like I hit my marks all that well. And yet it was my all-time best, so I'm thinking the track's a little bit faster. Um, not going to be able to be faster the second lap. Almost never happens in this car, unless you really mess up the first lap. Oh, and uh, I didn't execute as well during that lap anyway. Uh, but it will not matter. Because I don't know how to save tires in this car anymore. And uh, I'm sure by lap four I'll be self-spinning or something. But that's alright. Uh, I'm just here to have a fun time with a bunch of cool people. Seems like it might be a good race if I don't ruin it. <laughs> uh, who's ahead of me? Shane, awesome lap. One, two, seven. And Landon with a point one as well. So three people I know in the top three. Well, duh, I'm one of them, but. <laughs> Can I go out this way? Five. The answer is yes. Very interesting. <laughs> so, uh, we're all, uh, talking about, hey, looks like an idiot free server, except for insert name of person who is speaking here. <laughs> I guess I'm purely the easier, uh, Colton. What did you say? Sorry, what did you say? I didn't hear him. I'm just trying to figure out why I'm on both. Because I don't like either version of things. This is not my turn. That was a great lap, and I see what you mean now, Mark. Nice, uh, nice lap, one six six. <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering uh, what the decimal point would have been. <laughs> so, uh, I racing does like for ties like this. It's not an actual tie. That's a tenth, hundred thousandth, ten thousandth. So there is a some digit beyond here. Oh, no, don't tell me the ten is the one we have to look out for. Ten is uh not pressing the blue button, so we're waiting on him. Uh, oops, I just realized I don't have race labs up. Pardon me. We've got to know important information like strength of field and other things that really aren't all that important, but it's interesting. There we go. All better. We have time, since we're waiting around anyway. Is he here? The 10? Yeah, he is. That's the end of the session. Let's make us wait. That's cool. 
So, we are starting P3. I'd much rather start on the inside anyway, I think. I hope I don't do something stupid. This thing's so hard to drive. Uh, Nick in 9th, Gavin 11th. Got that unmuted good. We got uh, Rock Chan in here. Spencer. I mean, you know, tons of people win. Let me make sure my brake bias is where I want it. Everybody, buddy. Good. Good luck. Good qualifying, man. Go. Next time by, you'll be lining up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. My flap changes. All right. I'm going to I'm going to try to be easy with this car. It seems like a big key of it is staying close to the bottom and just knowing the right moment to get back on the gas. It seems like it's a big part of it. Not getting on the gas too early. Making sure you're using the brakes. It seems like using the brakes to uh, get the car rotating. Gotta Very important. Get back to Rocky Street and uh, explain what people would blow their engines to in that. Got people revving their engines, I guess. I hope it's a good race. It looks like. like when I was first starting out, I heard one race. There are three cars of five cars. Cool your engines like that. Have a good ride. I remember I did that a long time ago. That was like five in one race. Before I knew better, that was a really long time ago, probably like my fourth race ever. I don't consider that the good old days. <laughs> I'm glad to be away from that. I'm on the green, looks like a second gear start. I'll save a bit of fuel, I guess. Can't hurt. Seems like lately you've really wanted to go long in these races. And I think that's what I'll do this time as well. I mean, last time I did this, I got trapped a lap down. Was that last time? Maybe it was the time before, I don't remember. One of the times recently, I got trapped a lap down, which really stunk. Actually, I think last time was Martinsville. And I didn't post that race. Because I wasn't feeling good. The race was good. But, uh, just was not feeling good that week. So. All right, watching Shane. All right, close carriage, you're ready on to do your job. Green, 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 green. Outside. Clear. All right, so far so good. Outside. Keep low. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Keep low. P4. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear outside if you want it. Trying to keep the tires on it. Really want to be side by side with them, but that's just fine. No harm done. Single file, that's where I want to be. You've just done a 30.9. The car in front has just posted a 30.7. I really don't want to push it too hard on exit. I think uh, we could get some loose moments if I get too hard on the gas on exit and burn up the right rears or something. Could uh, lead us to trouble, so I'm going to be careful about that. Here's like here's a big key I think like right there on a, the exit of two, keeping it low on the track it seems to really help the lap times if you do that. Probably helps the tires as well, which is also good news. 
Landon might be burning his stuff up. Not sure though. I'm not the person to ask how to save tires, so he could be doing just fine. Shane and Mark up there got a little bit of distance. Just being patient with my inputs. The things will be A-OK. -okay. Your lap time was 31.0. Mark a little bit of the wall up there. I remember he had trouble at Martinsville, I believe. I did too, to be fair. I only uh, finished well because wrecks started happening and such. Even though it was green for the majority of the race. I hope I can keep the tires on this thing. So far it feels pretty good. I know tires don't matter as much anymore, but uh, they still do. They still do, for sure. But we'll see how they evolve as this run goes on. They're not driving away in the distance, so that's good. We're not losing a whole bunch of time trying to take it easy. Okay, I got session last lap up. I wasn't sure if I did or not. I'm sure we're, uh, I'm aware of the information I'm receiving. Okay, Colton. Lap times are pretty consistent. Got about a second back uh, between 5th and 6th. Or, you know, back to 6th. We have about a second. That's what I try I'm trying to say. We got a little bit of space, that's nice. Nothing huge, but room to work with. Feels like we might be reeling in the top two a little bit. Unless my eyes deceive me. does feel like it's getting kind of loose certain parts of the exit feels like it could definitely snap at uh, any moment I have to watch out for that speaking of snapping the five looking like it was getting weird on him he lost a ton of momentum doing that see so cutting down Not sure be patient no need to be in a hurry. That lap time was That was a pretty good corner. I just seem like they're driving in harder to one. Wonder if that will hurt them eventually. Oh, speaking of hurt, <laughs> looks like Landon almost hurt the wall. I think they had, he had to get off of it pretty good in order not to hit it there. Shane's still up there though. He's maintaining his pace pretty well, I think. Car outside. Outside is clear. Shit loser. Inside. Clear. 
We survived. <laughs> That's what this car likes to do lately. Just kind of start sliding like that. So third, all right. Patience working out okay for me. Gonna get a ton of time based on last lap after uh, having to slow down, letting that slide take its place in front of us. Shane's killing it, man. He's way up there. Doesn't seem like he's falling off, at least not yet. Billy's right on our bumper. Or at least pretty close. Keeping it smooth, it's feeling good. Like I said, definitely going to be going long. I've been uh, bitten by poorly timed pitting a couple times already this season in this car, so. Not going to put myself in that position again. equal with Landon, I think, on pace. Seems like it's really important to keep the brakes deployed for a good amount of time to keep the thing turning. Seems to be working out for me anyway. This is all essentially research. It's obviously the first time I've done this this week. I haven't watched anybody else do it. So I'm just reacting to uh, what I'm trying, what seems to be working. Seems to be going uh, pretty well so far. Ah, the uh, there's a caution. First caution. Alright, that's fine. We'll take four. We'll take gas. And uh, we'll restart right where we started the race, in P3. Might be a chance for Mark to uh, reset. Assuming he wasn't the caution. <laughs> Looks like he wasn't. He's back in 10th, he fell back. So he's probably going to be looking to uh, find a way to save tires a little bit better this time. He got the thing that I've been dealing with so many times this uh, season, like at Atlanta and Michigan. Where it just starts sliding through the corners. Just no grip whatsoever. I think it must have something to do with how they uh, wanted to improve the tire wear and how it works. Particularly like with the two tire strategy, so I think the left sides wear more now and I think maybe that's what's causing cars to get sideways. Lap times have barely fell off. Very interesting. I'm not sure why Landon's all this speed far back. Watch your speed limit in the pits. Pit lane speed limit is 45 miles per hour. We'll Doesn't want to, uh, to pass Shane, I guess, on pit road. <laughs> not interested, I guess. Pit box team, 10. 5. 3. 2. 1. Right here. Always like sharing my tires. We got some two tire takers. Uh oh. 
That was a 9190. Go, go, go! Be mindful, you only have one set of cars remaining. They want you in single file. Catch up, uh, slide and turn one didn't help me. Five ninety two. Oh, that sucks. You should be okay though. It's our open. One to go. Next time by. Alright, Colton. Get ready. Race the regime at the end of this lap. Wonder what happened. I wonder what the on my tires. Left sides were 97, 96. I think guys are going to be really loose on two tires. Got guys sliding like Mark already. So I hope they're careful. I wish them the best. You got loads of fuel. Got loads of fuel. We're fine now. Still seventh. So I'm okay with the four-tire call there. I don't think I needed to do anything too risky. We'll lose a couple spots, but uh, not have to contend with potentially dangerous driving conditions. So I'll uh, I'll take that trade. Pipe car is off. Green flag. Green flag. Green flag. The yellow flag is out. Well, that stinks. Single file. Pit road is closed. We didn't want to miss a gear. That must have been what happened, I guess. We didn't even get to a turn yet. <laughs> Pace car is out. Line up single file behind car number zero six. Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Only helping those people with the two tires, giving them less distance to run. Yeah, that was huge. That was huge? What happened back there? Was that a big wreck? Catch up, six, car. Pit road is now open. No idea what happened. Course yellow, pits are open. Might have been in my mirror, I didn't see it though. Catch up, six, car. Not trying to burn my tires off during caution laps. Keep them happy. This car is entering one. Mark must have taken two or none to get all that position back. See if Shane can make his way back forward. He was obviously very fast. And seemed like he could sustain it as well. But your current leader right now is Billy. Landon's still up there. And then a the couple of Gavins are both ahead of us now. So that uh, caution shook things up a bit for sure. we can actually go green this time. I hope it doesn't fall apart. We had a nice, decent run to start off here. Still plenty to go as well, so still going to be saving tires as normal. Just checking the fuel. Don't know why it would suddenly say uh, you can't make it, but that was good to check. All right, we'll try this again. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green.
we made it to and through the first corner. Everybody be able to keep the tires on at this run. that a little bit Gavin going for a pass on Gavin I think yeah Gavin on Gavin Prime. Patient on throttle, I didn't want to drift up drift up into him. Ooh, that got sideways a little bit. I'm gonna have to be careful. fun though. I'm uh, actually enjoying this more than I thought I would. Normally the setups have been just terrible, but uh, this isn't so bad. You definitely have to treat it with a lot of care, but it's not the worst. Other tracks have definitely felt worse this season. Uh oh, I saw a wall. Couldn't see who got it, but I saw wall dust. Shoot. Car outside. Clear outside. Oh. I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to scare you like that. We're under caution. It's closed. No issues, man. Not a problem at all. You're all good. feel like he's mad. I think he says that, but... Pace guard in three. Pete Road is now open. It's are open. I didn't break any later than I normally do. Honestly, it doesn't really feel that much different. <laughs> On two tires, I assume you mean. At least to me, I don't know. What, the pedal? pedal? Uh, two, uh, tires. two tires. Uh, you take two? Yeah, I was a little bit nervous they'd be too loose out of turn two, but I haven't really had a problem with them. Hmm. Yeah, I took uh, two. It actually feels better. It feels more neutral on two. Maybe you do want to take two tires then. I don't know how to feel about that. I mean... I wasn't going to hit him, I don't think. I had to break earlier than normal, but I don't think he needed to hit the brakes so hard. Or, like, stop braking for the corner. I don't know. Yeah, that's yeah. the worst feeling. <laughs> I just had to give it to you when you got down there. I was trying to turn it down, but then it just stayed on the top line. It wouldn't go any further, so I just... I might be talking about all these. Yeah, it's are open. Yeah, I got to turn down, and just so as I got no there, I tried to get on it and started pushing, I had to get off and keep it down and turn too much, so I know I put a lot of heat in there right front. Yeah, it's easy to do that. One to go, next time by. Okay, Colton, get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. 
don't know. I'm, I'm gonna have to look at it. I don't. I feel like I didn't drive in any harder than normal. I had to hit the brakes because he did brake a little bit more than normal, but or more than I was expecting. I mean, but I didn't feel like I was gonna hit him. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that one. I don't like that he wrecked. <laughs> I feel bad about that. Like, I always, I always try to brake right about whenever the Goodyear sign starts. And that's when I hit the brakes. Get ready, going mm. green. That sucks. The pace car is in. Green flag, green flag. Green flag. Well, we'll see if those two tires keep working for, for the other guys. Still feel like there's time for it to get really loose. Just trying to be smooth. Keep these tires happy. Don't recognize the guy behind us. He's been behind us for a little bit, though. Got Gavin in front of us. Nick's back in ninth, I see. He's looking to move forward potentially. Trying to be good and easy on the throttle so I don't light up the rears. I guess I do drive into three harder than most people. Seem like I catch them, but mm -hmm. Mark falling off again. Seems a little early. Maybe he's just trying to save better this time. Sure. Oh God! I think he hit the uh, safer barrier. Unless that was just eviction code. Outside is clear. Sixth place. That lap was a 31.4. Uh, you got a good exit there. The five did on the outside. I kind of like driving in that hard just so I can get my right front in on the action because my right rear is the one been getting worn. That was a 31.3. Just kind of stuck behind this battle. I don't want to force anything. Let this play out. Don't hit the apron. Good battle there, three. three. Mm -hmm. Sure, Gavin didn't want a battle. <laughs> but, uh. They got it all sorted.
just done a 31.3. Seven's right, uh, right on our rear end. Again. Oh. It's too early for tires again. Right? Just hit a 31.3. Yeah, oh, that's actually second off. I thought it was only a couple tenths off. Dang, what do we do now? Just, we're only halfway and we only got one set of tires left. I think I gotta save them. They weren't so bad last time. This was a shorter run. I believe. Hmm. Getting tricky. I'm sure this will be one of those cases where everybody pits and then I stay out, right? Nah, everyone's staying out. <laughs> I think we've got some takers back there. No, I don't think I want to lose any track position. It clearly seems to be important. Be able to send a message. Pits are open. Something to do. I, just, I think I scared him, and then he felt like he had to prevent himself from getting run over. Hmm. All right. I know he's really nice, so I don't know. I feel like he would be the type to be like, "Oh no, it's okay." Whenever it was definitely not okay. <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully he's alright. It looks like he's still, you know, he's right behind Nick. It's not too far back. Hopefully it didn't affect him too much. Get ready. Going green. It's been kind of hard to see the leader. Hide car is off. Green flag, green flag. Decent start there, though. Stop hitting the apron, please. I feel like I didn't do that at all, and then I just started doing it every other lap. And uh, I don't think I want to do that anymore. I don't think that's the right way to go about this. That looks like he's pushing pretty hard. Leader got a little sideways off exit there a little bit, I think. Everyone's being a little bit on edge, I think. I'm still saving for the most part. 
but I feel like saving is kind of just the way to go fast, too. It doesn't feel like you have to push very hard. I feel like it's just so easy to overdrive this thing. Just driving it normally is kind of just how you get around the quickest. Gavin going for another pass. He's making his way forward. Uh-oh. Mark's making his way to the left. <laughs> oh. Did he crash? Doesn't look like it. I think he just spun at the very wrong time. This car is out. Line up single file behind car number zero a five. We're under caution. It's closed. If everybody, if everybody else in front of me pits, I will. Otherwise, staying out. Ah. But then, what if everybody else pits? Oh my gosh. I'm so bad at making these decisions. I'm so bad at making these decisions. <sighs> it just doesn't feel like the pace is calling off much. Still haven't. Felt like I've pushed? I don't know. The leader, Roberts, is pitting. Watch your speed. Oh boy, what a split decision. Sounds like those guys are okay on the right. Can't see. Can't see. <laughs> 96-93. Alright, that's about time. Dang. Four got out of us at a time. Kind of missed my launch a little bit. I had a bad pit stop overall. Oh, everything's mixed up now. Four course yellow. Pits are open. One left to green. Hmm. Get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Got right sides. What were our lefts? 97, 96. That's that should be fine. So we're out of tires. No more tire pit stops. Eleventh place. Handful of people on old tires up ahead. Who I assume are saving tires for later which they will lose track position when they take those tires. So I think the... kind of feeling it. I don't regret this necessarily. Get ready, going green. Can't see. Post car is off, time to do your job. Green flag, green flag. Green flag. P11. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Keep low. Clear outside. Okay. Need a pass. You're in the top ten. Change position. That lap time was 30.9. Uh oh boy, I see guys getting kind of sideways.
What am I looking at? <laughs> All kinds of checked up up here. The car outside. Stay low. Stay low. Outside is clear. Wow. Careful there, 15. Hmm, checking out. All of a sudden, in the middle of the corner, that was dangerous. Inside. Stay high to the car on the low side. Stay high to the car on the low side. Clear. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear. Two wide. Go high. The yellow flag is out. They want you in single file. Closed. Pit road is closed. Half five, Alright. I don't even know what happened there. A thousand things. Someone getting run over. Me running into somebody that was running someone over, I think. Sixteen I need I need you to pass me I I don't know. Oh boy. Pete Road is now open. Four course yellow. It's are open. I don't know what happened. I guess we're okay. I don't think I got too much damage. We're going so slow through the corner. Nick has decided to take tires now. I believe that was Nick. Wasn't it? No. Come on, you have a mic, right? Yeah. How's my uh, left front look? Um, a little banged up, but I don't think it should be too bad. Five, yeah, same with your right front. Did you get spun there, or yeah, let's see what happened? Well, I think it started when I got collected. I think I was just a little slow in to uh, turn one. Someone behind me was a little fast. I got bumped and turned into the outside wall. Gotcha. Yeah, I tagged four as I saw everybody sitting in front of me trying to figure out what like line I need to take to avoid things. So, but things seem to be running fine, so I just want to make sure. Yeah, it could have been a lot cleaner, but I think there was just a lot of panic going on. Um, I almost made it out actually, but someone turned into me after uh, about five seconds or so. Race the regime at the end of this lap. Uh, just give you a heads up, 15, keep them behind me, I'm checking my RPMs real quick. Yep, I'm good. Hey, sorry about getting close to your bumper back there. I thought you were going to break a little bit later. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like I was just part of a chain reaction there. Oh, no worries. Chad. Get ready. Going green. Chain's a leader. Okay. And we got a 4X, but I think our car is okay. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Green, green, green. green. Go. Had to wait on the seven. Eighth place. Eight. Gonna block it off. Three. 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 Oh my gosh. Come on. I'd like to try to make some spots up here.
Thanks for throwing the dog loose, man. <sighs> well, Shane, I don't know if I'm going to get a chance to battle you. Anyway. Now open. It's open. That's what I'm thinking. I'm not going to have a chance to It'll pass really anybody. Cool if you did, but I'm okay if you don't. I'd love to win one this season. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I bet. <laughs> the last time we battled, it didn't work out. I got too tight and you won. I know. I was looking forward to that here, but if we don't do any laps on the green, I don't know if it'll ever happen. Yeah, I think it's all my fault. I caused the first caution and set off this chain of events. My bad. I don't know well, what's yeah, happening back there. A little run after that first caution, I felt like it. Maybe it's been all real quick. Yeah, that's kind of what happened when I raced Monday night. Good long run at the beginning, and then just a bunch of short runs because of cautions at the end. Well, we're running out of time. We get one green white checker now, I think. I feel like there's not even that many people behind us. So if I had to look at the schedule this season and pick tracks, I think I might win at this one would have been it. Anyone know what the uh, strength of field is for the race? One left to green. Three point one. I was going to answer. So. Copy. Thanks. Oh boy. Alright, let's try this again. I feel like I can get some spots, just need some time. Devin, I'm going to leave a little bit of room for these guys up here just in case if somebody misses the gear or if they get a bad start. Everyone behind me heard that. Because uh, that affects everybody yeah, behind you. If you get a run, I know you're on fresh tires. If you get a run, I'm not going to fight you too hard. That's a lot of space. <laughs> Landon. Oh boy, I guess we're closing up a little bit. The pace car is in. Seven with another iffy start. Kind of have to ease onto the throttle. I guess it's about time to go, though. I mean, I know we still have a fair number of laps left, but how many will be green? Car outside. Keep low. Clear high. Hmm. <laughs> why is he breaking so early? Holy cow, dude! Car outside. Clear outside if you want it. Really need to get by this guy now, or I'm gonna get run over. That last light was at oh my gosh, now they're side by side in front of me. I really need these guys to sort it out. Inside. Keep high. Still inside. Stay high. There's a car on the low side. You've just done a 31.1. Still inside. Still there, inside. Clear inside. Shane's wrecking. I'm so sorry, Gavin. 
Oh, you're good. I don't know how we live from that, but... <laughs> Really gotta watch out, the seven's been breaking so early into turn one. That was a uh, 31.1. Really got the wall behind me, I think. This is so backed up, this is scary. Inside. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Stay high. Seventh position. Still there at the bottom. Oh, don't uh, cause problems for Gavin again. up a little bit. I swear to God, that was not payback. I apologize. <laughs> I deserved it. <laughs> it's okay. I am so glad we were able to keep that going. There is a car on the high side. The gap in front has increased. It's now about one point seconds. Well, well, the universe worked itself out, I guess. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear high. P8. Well, that happened. <laughs> Oh, whoa, oh, that was weird. Car is really getting edgy on me. Might be the two tires, might just be I've been worse on them. Each time we got left, ten to go. Okay. Ten to go. This time by. The lap time was at thirty-one point six. Oh, someone in the wall. Hard. Is that Shane? No, I don't think so. Joe, maybe. I'm trying to tell by paint scheme.
Uh oh. Some issues happening up here. Landon in front of us again. We've been around him a lot this race. This is exciting. They're running into each other a lot up there. Sorry. Your lap time was 31.7. Hmm, can we get a nose on him? Mark, your left front looks like it's seen better days. Alright, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Hmm. Checked up for him. Got the car inside. Billy's deciding he's gonna be there. Still inside. Still there, inside. Oh boy. Clear inside. Inside. Clear inside. Oh my god, I'm always in the wrong lane. Clear inside. Three. You're in the middle. Three wide. Five. Clear outside. Two wide. Clear. Two wide. Clear inside. Fucking moron. Fucking ten just ran him over. Single file. Pit road is closed. Catch the fifth. Sorry, I just every time I get in the corner, twelve would just basically stop mid corner and just. I would have to keep checking up. Line up single file behind car number zero five. Yeah, I'm kind of having a force feedback issue. Well, I guess we get ninth. Checking up, dog. I was just always in the wrong freaking lane. Always someone checking up in front of me. No way to get around. <sighs> it may be. Probably is. Probably is. I think we get one green well, checker. We're gonna get the two to go here, then it's over. Don't we get one green white checkered or something now, though? No, no. it's only no. in the uh, winter in IS when you get two. Oh, okay. Green white check is in this series. Well, it's a one then. Yeah, we're gonna have a one lap shootout. Great. Yeah, yeah, and sorry about the day. I just, like I said, every time I would get mid corner and 12 would basically just break up and I just would have to continue to I thought that was it. check up myself, so. Until I didn't mean to come up on you there. Hey, Gavin, I'm going to send you for the walk and clear. Just try to both get out of the way so I can run it. <laughs> I just need you guys to miss all your gears and just let me drive away. I just need to have a lane. I just need to be allowed to pass somebody. They're always too wide in front of me. Right, I haven't been on pace uh, since that wreck, so you can take the inside when I get going. Whenever we see the fly, Yeah, Gavin, I'm on that. That's going to be a pin. I just hope it's not a wreck. Turn one. I'm just going to keep it low if you can get around me on the outside. I'm just keeping on the line. <sighs> I 
I really feel like I could be up there in the front, but I just yeah, have been stuck up, so long. The on the same set of left. Obviously, yeah, you don't need both. <laughs> I would have a stupid pit crew put off the wall. I feel like we're going to get an immediate caution. I hope not. Watch flag, watch flag. I guess we can't if it's a white flag, right? Green, 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 green. Catch up here. D9, white flag, one more lap. Saving tires anymore. That was really frustrating. Thank you for letting me win one of these, everybody. P9, that's it. Here's the flag. I did miss four, but I like to you. Great job. You did really well. Yeah, I can catch you though. I'll take the top five though after uh, having two bad turn twos. Yeah, second win in a row for Gavin. Yeah, yeah, I guess technically. Right, right, guys. That was a very frustrating race. I just yeah, stuck so behind fun, people for hours. You get your good point out of it. 16 trying to say something? What was that? I don't know what's going on anymore, man. I don't know if that was supposed to be... I don't know. We'll see the incidents, I guess, find out how stupid I am. I'm so frustrated with that. I felt like I was easily fast enough to be in the front. Is this the first caution? It's like 15. No reverse figure left. Right. Oh yeah, I have to. <laughs> I think Spencer mentioned that his self-spin or whatever was the first caution. Seventeen just runs over the uh Guy had that I guess missed a shift. Not quick enough reaction time, I guess. And then self spin, it looks like. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't going to hit him. <laughs> I braked at the normal spot. Right at the Goodyear sign. And he just braked harder than I normally do. And I, I would have spun myself before running into the back of him. But I didn't even need to get all the way on the brakes because I felt like it was fine. I don't know. I mean, I still obviously feel bad that he wrecked, but hey, I didn't touch him, and I wasn't going to touch him. I just drove in harder than he planned to, I guess. I don't know, man. 
<sighs> That's a very frustrating race for me. Hope they didn't kill you race there on lap 60. Happened lap 60. I just didn't slow down. Let's see what he's talking about. That was the big wreck. Where is that all happening? Okay. I didn't even see that happened. Yeah, I just I didn't even see him. I thought he was like stuck in here. Uh, I thought he like stuck to the wall and was back there and then. Just, I, I feel like I can never have a good race in this car anymore. I always ruin it somehow. Anyway, back to incidents. Lap 45. So spin. From 13th. Some team comes up and into the 10. Something's gonna roll in and turn it around. Not much going on there. Okay, yeah, here's the wreck. I don't know, I could have slowed down better too. just slowed down so much quicker than I was expecting. See, I see him getting sideways like that, and then I'm off the gas and on the brakes, just not on the brakes enough. I'm seeing him spin to the left, so I'm trying to make sure I can get around him. I think the guy's back there, and then he's actually right there. I suck. Teen spins it. Look what happened to Shane. Whoa! Getting all kinds out of control. I remember seeing that. I mean, I know we were... With the first, like, half of the race, it felt like we were just fine up in third, and it's just... I don't know. I picked the wrong strategy again, probably. I'm just dumb. Now, I don't know what the 10 is doing. Like, what? why would you just run into the back of him? Who is that? Sorry, 10. I don't know him. Like, I don't know what... Let's, let's watch this from the beginning, I guess. Trying to get to the end. I'm just constantly stuck behind whatever lane's going slower. I'm hoping the 10 didn't take me inside. Green flag dropped. Wait, it was lap 60, not 45. Uh, I 
don't know what he's talking about back here. I mean, that's, <laughs> that's a bit of a stretch. I mean, that's three laps I go. I mean, I guess he's still alongside him for a while, but then... I mean, you could say butterfly effect, but... <laughs> that was years ago. just feel like I got really unlucky there and I made I was make, doing stupid stuff made dumb decisions as usual I think we saw some of this already okay right we were gonna look at uh, how this transpired Stuck behind him, the five like drifts up into Landon's lane, so he has to check up. <sighs> oh. It's way aggressive. I know it's late in the race, but he's just drifting right in front of him, right into his lane. Like we would have been fine too. Nine gets into him. But we all lose a bunch of momentum. And then the ten just flies in and runs him over. We were fine. Like, why did he do that? That's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Just never even lifts at all. Like, what do you think? What did you think was going to happen? What possible positive result comes from this? It's just incredibly, very dumb. I'm sorry. So we get more incident points just because he gets run over. Oh, just, everything's frustrating. And then the five, who kind of started that chain reaction, just drives into the wall as the caution comes out. <sighs> Final lap. I don't know what's going on anymore. So the 10's passing the 13, and then I guess the 13's trying a crossover by going to the apron? And then just runs into the back of him and spins himself? And then collects Billy. I mean, as for as bad as my race was, Billy's race was, as usual, worse. He's got the worst luck of anybody, probably. So, well, what do I have to complain about? There's another guy that has nothing to complain about. There's Gavin, the winner. Gavin, Nick, I, and I get, I'm ninth. So I do everything wrong. I, uh, I'm being negative again, I'm sorry. Leftover negativity from last week being really bad, I guess. Uh, sorry. Just very frustrating. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about half of that. But that'll do it, I guess. Um, I mean, we still finished half in the middle of the field. I just, I feel like I was faster than the seven. Probably could have kept up with Jan. I feel like I easily had a top five. Guess I should have, uh, I mean, Gavin never even pit. His last time he pit was lap 22, so why do, why do I go in the pits? Why do I make stupid decisions all the time? I don't know. Uh, that's it. I'm done. I'm just going to be mad at myself some more. See you later. Have a good one.